That's perfect. I got it. I got it. Mascot. Clee, maybe you could think up an even better role for Miss Adia. A mascot, you say? Isn't that a character that doesn't have to actually do anything and sits around letting everyone else do all the... It sounds like the idea of being lazy is pretty exciting to her. <laughs> the mascot serves to maintain troop morale, Adia. Don't underestimate your role. Oh, all right. I'll be the mascot then. That's right. Thank you for bringing these new friends here safely. You can go off and play now. Thanks, Water Droplet. See ya! Hmm? Huh? Water Droplet? Is that your pet name for it? <laughs> I suppose it's as accurate a nickname as any. We keep getting sidetracked. But I believe you were saying something about being in a difficult predicament. Is something wrong with the Valeria Mirage? Oh, yes. About that. I'm afraid the entire domain has recently sustained some significant damage. It was as if the whole world was suddenly flipped upside down. A few components went missing from the core, which sustains the domain, and the impact cascaded out from there. Needless to say, many things in the Valoria Mirage have now stopped working. Just days after I agreed to let my friend's daughter come and visit too. When oh, so your mom's friend? Hi, Auntie Desert. I'm Klee. Here, I brought the magic invite, see? Huh? Wait, so you're... you're? Look how dilated her pupils are. She must be very surprised. Yeah, and <laughs> not in a good way. Mom's the one who sent me here. She's the strongest mage ever. She said that her friend lives in the desert. You live in the desert, so that must be you. Right, Auntie Desert? Ah, I see. So being a mage runs in the family. Uh, you're... You're Alice's daughter? Oh, I just want the ground to swallow me up right now. Wait, that's it. I'll hide myself away in the core of the domain. <laughs> hide there until this all blows over. See you all in a hundred years. Idea's really going through it. She's like a shriveled little forest fungus, hanging its head in shame. Kali, that's a harsh analogy. Where'd all that come from? Don't worry, Auntie Desert. Klee's here to help you. And all my friends will help, too. Just take a deep breath, and then another... Yeah, don't you worry. Sir fix -a -Lot over here has a good track record with this kind of thing. Well, I'm useless. But it looks like that won't matter with all you capable people around. Fantastic! Don't put yourself down, Adia. You're great, too. Thanks for your encouragement. Anyway, for the time being, please talk amongst yourselves. That'll give me some time to think things through and maybe make a start on, um, delegating. says that you're from Watatsumi Island. What's it like there? There must be loads of fish, right? Wait! You look kind of like a mermaid. Are there fish in your family? Oh, <laughs> sorry to disappoint you, Miss Mage, but I'm just an ordinary human. I have lots of great stories about Watatsumi Island, though. Come on, let's enjoy the scenery while I tell you all about it. Feeling nervous, Kale? Well, it's your first time as a guide, after all. Hmm? Oh, no. <laughs> Not at all. I'm just, uh, still settling into the role. So I was thinking about how to talk more like Master Tainari. Well, the easiest way to imitate someone is to start with their most common turns of phrase. Oh, okay. 
In that case, uh... <clears throat> put that mushroom down! <sighs> now! It's highly poisonous! There you go! With just a few simple words, you've captured your master's personality perfectly. Anyway, what about your role? Don't you mind being the master thief? It doesn't sound like you're one of the good guys. <laughs> Maybe not. Until you factor in that I only steal from the enemy. I think that's enough to make me one of the good guys, don't you? Oh! Uh, fair point, fair point. Emerge! Right now! Right here! Hmm? Who else has visited the Valorian Mirage recently? Uh, there was someone from the Academia who came not long ago. A Kasharawar scholar. Blonde hair. Architect, I think. He was a huge help, and redesigned many of the buildings here. Although he was always grumbling to himself. He was extremely diligent in his work. Ah, <sighs> what a kind person. I could tell that was a sensitive soul. A lot like me. Uh, sorry. Please pretend you didn't hear that. <clears throat> I'm, of course, a very uh, strong and resilient person. After him, an aristocrat from Mondstadt showed up. Then the gen... I mean, Miss Sangonomia. Unfortunately, everything here suddenly started changing before I had the chance to be a good host and show them around. Do you know where the Mondstadt aristocrat is now? If I remember correctly, it's a pity we're having all these issues. Hmm. If we could get everything working normally again, I could probably locate him in an instant. Still, not to worry. There's nothing dangerous here. Hmm. Hey, Idea! You got an update for us? We've all caught up with each other. Very well. Then please allow me, Idea, your mascot, to explain exactly what's happened here. Basically, this entire domain is powered by a device called the Central Hub, which you all saw earlier. But following a major incident, several key components from the Central Hub came loose and went flying. Four components. Oh, so that thing's supposed to spin? Yes, it definitely shouldn't be frozen still like it is now. At least, that's not how it was when I first got here. Oh, I've done such a terrible job of taking care of it, it's so embarrassing. Hey, everything's gonna be okay. Hmm. So, we need to fix the big wheel up there. And to do that, we need to find the missing parts. Right. I do know where one of the parts is. It landed not too far away. But the rest all landed in different areas. I'm afraid you'll have to go and look for those. <clears throat> now, as the caretaker and your mascot, I shall announce your respective adventure duties. Um, you can just be yourself if you want. No need to force the whole role-playing thing. <laughs> oh, I see. Um, okay, so I was thinking that maybe Swordmaster Eula and Healer Kale could investigate the Northern Zone, if that's okay? Fine by me. I was going to be looking for my cousin there anyway. I'll be your backup, Eula. I know you usually team up with Amber, so I'll try my best to fill her shoes. Oh? Well, this'll be fun. Let's see if a forest ranger can outperform an outrider. Master Thief Kaya and Mage Klee, if you could earmark some time in your busy schedules to search the West Zone. Earmark? What does that mean? It just means we mustn't forget to do it. Don't worry. We can handle that. Finally, we have our general, Miss Sangonomia, and our knight, the Traveler. If there's no objections, please come with me to retrieve the first component. Wow! Spoken like a true knight! <laughs> then, for my part, my strategic mind is at your service. All right, well, if anyone finds anything, come back here and we'll regroup. Please take care while you're out on the road and look after each other, especially our little mage here. You got it! I'll take extra special care of Kaya. 
I'll be on my best behavior. Uh, okay, we'll leave it there for now. You two, please follow me. I remember seeing it just behind the central hub. So, how come you didn't bring it back when you first saw it? I'd have been more than happy to, if this one component was enough to fix the whole domain. But with three other components to find... Oh, I suddenly felt overwhelmed by how much work needed doing. Hmm. Paimon kinda gets that. Taking the first step is always the hardest part. in Watatsumi Island for now. So I thought I'd take the chance to get out and see more of the world. You've traveled a pretty long way. Why Kamiru? I figured that I needed to venture further than usual to really broaden my horizons. Well, that's one reason anyway. I can explain in more detail another time. Okay, now, I'm sure you're both wondering, oh, but where's the component? There is nothing here. Oh, where could it be? Oh, it's that lamp thingy, right? Water droplet showed us how that works. Uh, yes, ugh, that's the one. There goes my big introduction. <laughs>